Good morning, motor cars. It's going to be a great day. The day is April 5th, 2013. For what it's worth, Sunday is recognized as being no housework day. So if Sunday ends up being a beautiful day, you might want to play that card. Kick back and enjoy the day. I hope everybody, all the departments are making good progress with their spring cleanup. I know I am. Uh, make sure you get your videos into Mike Buner. Yesterday's answer. Uh, what was the first product to have a barcode? It was Wrigley's gum. Uh, many of you got this one right, and so congratulations and thank you for participating. Uh, so I decided to give, uh, have two winners instead of one, and congratulations to Mike Buner and Andrew Shirelli. Today's challenge. The first employee that contacts me with the correct answer will get a free car wash. Now, please, no Googling or cheating on this one. How can turtles breathe? Let me know. Uh, this day in history, 1614, Pocahontas married John Rolfe. 1955, Sir Winston Ch Churchill resigned as Prime Minister of Britain. In 1976, Howard Hughes died. We have a couple birthdays. Uh, Saturday is Victor in the Reconditioning Department's birthday. And Sunday will be sending the Toyota's office birthday. So happy birthday and have a great one, guys. Uh, anniversaries. Uh, today, Donald and Toyota Sales Department is celebrating its third anniversary. And uh, Andre in the uh, Honda Service Night, Night Service Advisor is celebrating his seventh year on Sunday. So congratulations goes out to all. Um, don't forget that um, Monday is going to be birth retirement and also it's going to be the Indians opener. So wear your Indian shirts, please. Uh, Gina's journey. Gina is a 21-year-old college student and Jane Seidman's cousin's daughter. Uh, she was diagnosed with a malignant brain tumor in February of 2012. Her journey was as included brain surgery as well as months of extensive physical, occupational, speech, and radiation and chemotherapy. Through her treatment, through, Gina lost her hair. She found herself in a quest to substitute hats for, to find suitable hats and hair cover. Gina has established a place for the cancer patients to find a hat or hair cover at no charge to them. Gina is collecting hats and square head scarves for distribution to patients undergoing cancer treatment at the pediatric and adult infusion centers at the UA, at UH's Seidman Cancer Center and UH Case Medical Center. All items collected will be dry cleaned. Uh, before distribution. Motor Cars is going to collect be a collection center and anybody that brings in a donation we will give them a free car wash. We will hand out flyers at the car wash and hopefully those people will bring, car, bring hats in the next time through and get a free car wash. Um, all the service people making service appointments we're going to send out an email asking them to participate in the hat drive. We would like our employees to bring in hats and they also will get a free car wash. Ted is now back on vacation and uh, he will be working on this project Monday making flyers to go around and boxes for distribution in the places to put the hats. Blossom Time Run. Motor Cars will once again sponsor the 37th annual Blossom Time Run uh, on May 26th in Chagrin Falls. Motor Cars sponsored this run for over 20 years and we are very excited to be the lead sponsor again. I'd like to encourage as many of our employees as possible to participate in it. It's a very tough, hilly, 5.25 mile course. Anybody that's interested in running the race, let Trevor know and he will get you registered and we're going to have some special motor car shirts made up for the participants. I haven't run in over 10 years and I'm getting kind of inspired about taking, you know, you know, starting my training to maybe participate in. So I think I'm going to go home that night and put on my shoes and start training. Well, all I can say, guys, again, thank you for making motor cars a special place to work. Have a great weekend.